Today we are going to show you the best soundbars you can buy right now. We have analyzed the market and listed these 5 best soundbars for you. For more amazing tech product reviews and suggestions please subscribe to our channel. We will try our best to present you the best tech products which you can buy now. In this video, we'll be covering best soundbars, including what they are, why you may want to choose them, and some of the best options out there. Number 5 The Bose Smart Soundbar 900 is a standalone 5.0.2 setup with a premium design. Unlike its predecessor, the Bose Smart Soundbar 700, it supports Dolby Atmos content, often found on different streaming platforms. It uses the manufacturer's face guide technology to beam sound throughout your room to create a wide, immersive soundstage, and you can even upgrade it with a separate subwoofer and satellites as the Bose Smart Soundbar 900 with speakers plus bass module for a more immersive experience. Like most premium bars, there's also a room correction feature on hand to optimize audio based on your room's unique acoustics, which Bose calls ADAPTQ. The Bose Smart Soundbar 900 is good for mixed usage. Thanks to its room correction feature, it can automatically optimize audio reproduction based on your space. It has a neutral sound profile suitable for many types of audio content. It supports Dolby Atmos and surround content, too. Unfortunately, it doesn't reproduce a very extended low bass, so you don't feel the deep thump and rumble in action-packed movies or bass-heavy music. You can always add a sub and satellites to improve the performance. Number 4, the Sony Heights G700 is a 3.1 channel soundbar from 2020. It can support all common audio formats via its HDMI arc and full HDMI in ports, and if you like to watch movies, it can also play Dolby Atmos content, but it has to downmix it into stereo. Although it has a fairly boomy sound profile, there are 7 EQ presets available that can enhance your audio experience, depending on what kind of content you like to listen to. It can also get pretty loud, but there's a lot of thumping and compression at max volume, which is disappointing. The Sony HTG700 is good for dialogue and TV shows. Even though it has a boomy sound profile, it's still able to produce voices clearly and accurately. It can get loud enough to fill a large room or crowded environment, and there's also a dialogue enhancement feature to make voices more clear. You can also use Bluetooth to stream your favorite podcasts or audiobooks to the bar. Number 3, the Sonos Arcade is the manufacturer's flagship soundbar released in 2020. Like most Sonos products, it has a sleek and premium design, with built-in voice assistant capabilities for hands-free control. Dolby Atmos and DTS-X support gives you access to lots of different content on streaming platforms and Blu-rays, and you can upgrade the standalone bar to the Sonos Arc with Sub Plus One SL speakers if you wish. With the Sonos S2 app, you can pair the bar with other products in your Sonos ecosystem to spread sound throughout your home. The Sonos Arc is good for mixed usage. It's a really premium standalone bar that's suitable for everything from music to movies to TV shows. Right out of the box, dialogue is clear and accurate, and instruments are reproduced with fidelity. It supports lots of different audio formats, too, including Dolby Digital and Dolby Atmosphere. You can always add on a sub and satellites to improve its performance down the line. Number 2 The Vizio M-Series M512AH6 It's a mid-range offering from the manufacturer that's one of the few bars in its price range to include rear satellites for a more immersive surround sound. As with many Vizio bars, you have to wire the satellites to the sub, which isn't ideal for every living room setup. Without up-firing drivers on its satellites, it doesn't sound quite as immersive as the more premium Vizio Elevate. However, the two upfiring drivers in the bar make a real difference with Dolby Atmos content, especially compared to budget selections like the Vizio M Series M51 AH6. The Vizio M512 AH6 is great for mixed usage. It's a versatile 5.1.2 bar that stands out compared to other bars at its wallet friendly price point. Plug it into your TV, and voices and lead instruments are clear right out of the box thanks to its balanced sound. 
the sub brings rumble in the bass to bring bass-heavy genres and action-packed scenes to life, and its satellites add to the immersive feeling with movies. Compared to more premium offerings, it doesn't bring the same cinematic feeling, especially with Atmos content, but if you're on a tighter budget, it's a solid pick. Number 1 The Samsung HWQ990B is the top-of-the-line offering from the manufacturer's 2022 lineup. With its 11.1.4 setup, it's the next generation of the Samsung HWQ950A, with a new and improved design overall. It seems more sturdy, with more rumble in the bass right out of the box, and new angled rears that add lots of detail to your favorite movies. It's larger and more expensive than the 9.1.4 Samsung HWQ930B, with two more channels and a big sub that packs a potent punch in the bass range. As with most Samsung bars, you get access to a wide range of sound enhancement features, so you can customize its sound and pair it with compatible Samsung TVs for extra tools like Q-Symphony. The Samsung HWQ990B is excellent for mixed usage. This 11.1.4 bar offers versatile performance, with a neutral sound that makes it suitable for everything from vocal-centric TV shows to music to movies. You have access to lots of customization tools, making it easy to adjust the bar's sound based on your preferences. Its rear speakers bring an immersive quality to the sound, so audio seems like it wraps all around you. There's good height, especially with Dolby Atmos content, bringing a cinematic experience right to your living room. It's a great bar, but its premium price tag may not be ideal for everyone. All of the best soundbars are on our list please click the thumbs up icon if you found this video to be helpful which soundbars would you choose let us know what you think by leaving a remark below thank you. For your time click the like button and subscribe to channel if you found this video. To be useful in any way so you won't miss any upcoming updates all of you who viewed before that I hope to see you in the upcoming video.